5. Simple derivations. We now have four inference rules, MP, MT, MTP1, and MTP2. How do we utilize these in demonstrating other arguments of sentential logic are also valid. In order to prove show, demonstrate that an argument is valid, one derives its conclusion from its premises. We have already seen intuitive examples in an earlier section. We now redo these examples formally. The first technique of derivation that we examine is called simple derivation. It is temporary, and will be replaced in the next section. However, it demonstrates the key intuitions about derivations. Simple derivations are defined as follows. Definition A simple derivation of conclusion C from premises P1, P2, Pn is a list of formulas also called lines satisfying the following conditions. 1. The last line is C. 2. Every line formula is either a premise 1 of P1, P2, Pn, or follows from previous lines according to an inference rule. The basic idea is that in order to prove that an argument is valid, it is sufficient to construct a simple derivation of its conclusion from its premises. Rather than dwell on abstract matters of definition, it is better to deal with some examples by way of explaining the method of simple derivation. Example 1 Argument P. PQ. QR slash R simple derivation 1 PPR 2 PQ PR 3 QR PR 4 Q1 2 MP5 R3 4 MP This is an example of a simple derivation. The last line is the conclusion. Every line is either a premise or follows by a rule. The annotation to the right of each formula indicates the precise justification for the presence of the formula in the derivation. There are two possible justifications at the moment. The formula is a premise annotation PR. The formula follows from previous formulas by a rule annotation line numbers, rule. Example 2 argument PQ. QR. R slash P simple derivation 1 PQ PR 2 QR PR 3 R PR 4 Q 2 3 MT 5 pages 1 4 MT example 3 argument P. PR. QR slash Q simple derivation 1 P PR 2 PR PR 3 QR PR 4 R 1 2 MP 5 Q 3 4. MT these three examples take care of the examples from section 2. The following one is more unusual. Example 4 argument PQP. PQ slash Q simple derivation 1 PQ PPR 2 PQ PR 3 pages 1, 2, MP 4 Q 2, 3, MP What is unusual about this one is that line 2 is used twice, in connection with MP, once as minor premise, once as major premise. One can appeal to the same line over and over again, if the need arises. We conclude this section with examples of slightly longer simple derivations. Example 5 Argument PQR PR P slash Q simple derivation 1 PQR PR 2 PR PR 3 PPR 4 R2 3 MP5 QR1 3 MP6 Q4 5 MTP2 Example 6 Argument PQR PQ Q slash R simple derivation 1 PQR PR 2 PQ PR 3 Q PR 4 pages 2 3 MT5 QR1, 4, MP6 R3, 5, MTP1 Example 7 Argument PR PQ, PQ, RPQ slash P Simple Derivation 1 PR PQ PR 2 PQ PR 3 R PQ PR 4 PR 1, 2, MTP2 5 R2, 3, MT6 Pages 4, 5, MTP2 Example 8 Argument PQ, QR and S, R and S, PT slash T simple derivation 1 PQ PR 2 QR and SPR 3 R and SPR 4 PT PR 5 Q 2 3 MT 6 pages 1 5 MT 7 T 4 6 MT P 1